The following Diva Contest is scheduled for one fall. Making your way to the ring from Norwich, England, Paige. Oh, this place is coming alive now. I assure you, you do not want to mess with these Divas. They are intense. And approaching the ring, accompanied by Laura, representing Too Cool from Miami, Florida, Layla. Oh man, here comes Layla, and a lot of jaws just dropped. She's stunning. The only thing this diva cares about is winning. She couldn't care less about what the fans here think of her. Her priorities are correct. And there's the bell. Michael, don't forget the best part. We've got divas. Into the tie-up they go, but who's going to end up with the upper hand? Well, I think it's too difficult to tell, even from this angle. No one's backing down here. What an impasse. Man, Michael, this is a standstill of epic proportion. No one wants to give an inch. Well, on the topic of Paige here, tell us your thoughts. When you've been in this business for literally your entire life, like Paige has, you know what you have to do inside that ring to be successful. And what I think I like most about Paige is that she's not afraid to get a little dirty in there. She, like all the divas in the WWE, is an amazing athlete, Michael. But just how amazing? I think we're going to find out tonight. Quit running your mouth and let them do this thing. Finds a way out. Uh oh, what are we going to see here? You mentioned Paige's willingness to get dirty earlier. I noticed that she likes to go to the hair pull toss quite a bit. And when she's got her opponent down, she'll kick and stop her like there's no tomorrow. Yeah, but at the same time, she's an incredibly gifted technician. Her fisherman suplex is among the best I've seen. And that cradle DDT, or rampage as she likes to call it, is so dangerous. Not today, too fast. Oh, out of nowhere. That landed perfectly. This isn't where Paige wants to be. A head pounding bulldog. And they haven't done it yet, check out WWE.com. You'll find updates and blogs from all your favorite superstars. Yeah, and don't forget to check us out on Twitter. It's at Jerry Lawler and at Michael Cole. Right, Michael Cole? Yeah, that's original. We've seen Paige put away so many divas with her PTO. A Scorpion crosslock, she says, was inspired by former WWE Women's Champion Paul Nakano. That was rough. Covers. And she raises her shoulder to interrupt the referee's count. She sure did. Impressive kick out by Paige. But I'm not sure how much fight she has left in her. Layla capitalizing on her speed. And this heartless attack continues. Oh man, this is getting tough to watch. A textbook maneuver there. In addition to the PTO you brought up earlier, King, we've also seen Paige down many a diva with her page turner. In fact, 
It was the page turner that put AJ Lee down and gave Page the Divas Championship. Well, between the page turner and the PTO Scorpion crosslock, I don't know why any of the Divas even agree to face Page. She's just so devastating inside that ring. I can't believe the referee didn't see that. A knockdown drag out brawl complete with a big stomp. Man, these guys are throwing bombs. They're pulling out all the stops. Layla has the neck. She might end it here, Cole. Uh oh, the face left. Hey, I could use one of those. Michael, here's something that'll blow your mind. The first time Paige was actually in the ring for a professional match came before she was even born. That's right, her mother, who was also a wrestler and obviously didn't know she was pregnant at the time, actually competed in a match while Paige was in her womb. Look at the eyes. We're looking at complete... Paige has got the WWE Universe paying close attention here. Are we gonna see it? Paige Turner. She's closing the book right now. I'd like to take a page out of her book and look at it all night long. Paige is going for it early. Two. Oh, this will bring everybody to their feet. I'm having a hard time figuring out what they're going to do next. Me too. I've given up even trying to figure out what they're going to do next. I'm just sitting back watching and enjoying. Paige finding a path of destruction currently. Not this. Warm up the buses. This one's over. And this has got to be it. Yeah, maybe. Two. A fever pitch is here in the WWE Universe. You're right about that. The crowd is buzzing. They're ready for this thing to get underway. You can hear the human body enter a state of human ruin. No kidding. Did you just say UG? The toll from this match is really starting to show. Oh no, she's in a bad way now. All these power moves tonight are making bigger and bigger impacts. Cole, will she win it here? I think so. Two. A lot of chatter on social media over this Divas match here tonight. Look at the intensity from Paige. It's one impressive move after the other from this second generation competitor. Oh, what a shot. That did some serious damage. You can't take too many of those and expect to be in the match much longer. Each of these competitors is looking for the slightest hit of weakness in the other. Well, that's a strategy you have to always have in the back of your head, Cole. If you ever see a weakness in your opponent, you got to jump on it. She's going to need to dig down deep if she wants to keep going now. This takes the adage of practice makes perfect and takes it in a completely new direction. No kidding. Over and over, the same new direction. Quick thinking to avoid that. Page better shake out the cobwebs. And this has got to be it. I think so. Three. What a huge 
huge win. Here's your winner, Layla. Nicely done, picking up the win here. I don't care how many wins you have, whenever your hand is raised in victory, a certain level of excitement comes over you. And that's the kind of action we've come to expect here on Raw. What an amazing match. You mentioned Paige's willingness to get dirty earlier. I noticed that she likes to go to the hair pull toss quite a bit. And when she's got her opponent down, she'll kick and stop her like there's no tomorrow. Yeah, but at the same time, she's an incredibly gifted technician. Her fisherman suplex is among the best I've seen. And that cradle DDT, or rampage as she likes to call it, is so dangerous. Paige gets taken off her feet. Yeah, I don't know if Paige ordered a wake-up call, but she sure got one. Here we go. The running super kick. The end is near. And the party is over. She's trapped. I'm told her photo galleries are responsible for a good portion of WWE's documentary.